Hello YouTube, uh, Canon just uh, got a new firmware update, uh, it's called the 1.6 and, uh, and this firmware is about, is supposed to not overheat anymore and uh, yesterday after I uh, updated the firmware um, I was recording in multiple uh, formats and I could not um, overheat my R5. Now I will do a test, a longer test with 8K RAW, 8K LI, uh, 4K 60, 4K 120 frames per second and, uh, and 4K um, fine, this uh, downscale from 8K, to see how, uh, how it will perform. Uh, it's supposed to, I think uh, R5 just became a very serious, powerful um, video camera. Let's see how uh, will be Let's see how will the test will be the test. The I, I record the screen with a action cam uh, because I don't have an Atomos Ninja to record the the screen the the display and I will record the, the screen with one uh, action cam. Okay, let's uh, let's do the test. In the menu to the eight auto power off temp temperature. It's you can choose standard or high. And here we chose high. And now to do the test in 8K RAW, 24 frames per second. Let's start. So my battery from the action cam was died and I not put another battery. Um, as you can see, the, I couldn't record continuously without no overheating problem. Um, and yeah, this firmware is excellent. Look like this problem is, is gone. Okay, good job Canon with the new firmware. And uh, tell me what you think in the comments below. And yeah, see you in the next video. Bye bye. Ciao.